Hey guys! Thank you for joining us. I'm Raquel. I'm Jake. And this is our second Don't You Know special. It's a Don't You Know Extra. Extra. Oh, I guess I could have been using that instead of special. Hmm, too late. <laughs> anyway. Cool. Uh, so, do you want to say what we're doing? Or should I say, because I probably know more. We are taking for each other uh supernatural quizzes um to find out which supernatural creature we might be mythical creature might it be and then we are going to attempt to guess the supernatural creature that we got for each other for ourselves by asking a series of questions until we figure it out yeah should we put a limit on how many questions should it be like that guess who game where you ask a question and then you have a chance to take a guess of who you are. Are you talking about the game called 20 Questions? I forgot how many questions they give you. Well, there's 21 questions. You ask, you ask each other 21 questions. There's also the game Guess Who, where you have like that board with all the little faces on it. And oh, you go, you go do I have like, so glasses? Fun. And then you can take a guess. If that's a yes, then you can either ask another question or you can take a guess of who you are. Yeah. Should we do Are it that you way? wearing glasses? I don't have a board. You didn't tell me to bring one. Oh, I don't have a board either. I'm just saying, like, we can ask a question. If it's a yes, you can take a guess or ask another question. Or do we not want to I do like that? I like 20 questions. I like, 20, I like questions? 20 questions. And I think that you can do a little, like, counter and that would be pretty good. Okay, so 21 questions, but after That's a question, a lot of you can... That's editing, though. <laughs> so, after... so after the question, you can take a guess. Because I'm trying mm -hmm. to make it so it's not too, too long. So we just sit here and just ask each other questions. And just questions. And just questions. I'm going to get mine quick. Oh, are quickly. you? Quickly. Are you sure? Yeah. I already I know what it is. <laughs> <laughs> I don't okay. think you're going to get yours either. We'll just figure out when we're struggling. We'll be like, no, you're just you're so far wrong. All right. Okay. Do we so, start? How do we start? So, okay. Well, first, so we're going to do questions, and then you can take a guess of what you think you are. And then it'll switch. Yeah. Okay. So we get a guess every time? Yeah. Okay. Okay. Do I Wait, hold on. Have... Hold on. These people, I have to put in a chance for them to see the questions that we answered for each other. And they get to oh. Or should I do that afterwards so that way they don't know what we are either? Ooh. I think that I'll just show okay here's guys how we answered the questions but I won't show you the results just yet until after we guess it you can say skip to this timestamp if you don't want to see it if you want to guess along and then you can always go back and listen now I'm gonna do it my way okay do it your way <laughs> so Perfect. here's here you guys you can see um are us answering each other's questions and then I will put the results after we guess what our results are. How do you spend your Friday nights? Let's see. Jacob. Hmm. Netflix marathon. Nah, he really doesn't do very many of those. Small get together with friends. He doesn't like to dance, so it's definitely not that one. Uh, let's go with hit the bars. He likes to play darts and stuff like that, so. Um, I think she's going to be a werewolf. I mean, I just think that's what's going to happen. Preferred pet. Oh, wow. Is there a scary spider or snake here? Okay. Um, hmm. Let's see. He has had cats and dogs before, but I don't think they're his favorite. It's either between a fish or a mouse. He had he had rats last time, so I don't think they're quite the same as mouse. So let's go with a fish. Which mythical creature are you? Pick a combination of the elements. Um, 
She likes Avatar. I think she'd be like Wind and Fire or Earth and Fire. Yeah, probably Earth and Fire. Jacob, don't be offended if I get these wrong. <laughs> Your friends describe you as... Oh, I can answer this one because I am his friend, so... <laughs> Let's see. Cool, collected, and concentrated. A dreamer, heads in the clouds, down to earth, logical, kind, wallflower, fun, fierce, and free. Quiet, but you got a white side. Mmm... Huh. He's not really much of a wallflower. He can be, I guess, but I don't tend to let him be one. <laughs> um, I wouldn't really think of him as fierce. Hmm. Mm -mm. Let's see. I guess... So I'm thinking down to earth and logical and kind because he is kind. He's down to earth, logical. Not to say he's not, but he, when I think logical, personality-wise, I think of like almost like computer-like with no emotions. And Jacob obviously has has emotions. Hmm. Cool and collected and concentrated. He can be those things. I'm going to go with down to earth and kind. Just because anytime I do think of Jacob, it's like down to earth is like the biggest thing. The Hobbit, you're short. Ha <laughs> ha! Oh, no, that's mean. I'm just teasing. But. Boom, that was a roast. <laughs> um, how about the Fellowship of the Ring? Because you have the core group of friends. I think that'll work. The motto you live by is Carpe Diem. Go with the flow and have fun. I'm thinking that one. Uh, I'm not even going to attempt to pronounce that because you guys know I can't pronounce words. Uh, the die has been cast. Eh. True beauty is on the inside, not out. A book is one thing you buy that makes you richer. Oh, that's a good one. I've never heard that before. Family is forever. I'm going to have to go with Jacob as go with the flow and have fun. What is a hero to you? Someone foolish enough to pick a side, an obstacle, someone who believes in magic, um, someone with a pure heart, dinner, someone who rises to the occasion, someone who protects nature and annoyance, someone who uses their strength wisely. I know she likes Dragon Ball Z and Superman maybe, or maybe she likes to have them fight. Um, both of those use their strength wisely and have pure hearts. Um, we're going to say use their strength wisely. Oh, your zodiac sign. Oh no, Jacob, I don't know what your zodiac sign is. I have to, I have to look it up. I'm sorry, I know what your birthday is. I just, I don't know when your zodiac sign is. Zodiac sign, let's see here. December. 28th zodiac sign Capricorn okay Jacob you're a Capricorn what do you look for in a significant other quick wit tenacity strong swimming skills I know she wants like a surfer dude uh, hit her up if you know how uh, long blonde hair is a plus <laughs> strong swimming skills longevity sense of adventure optimism level-headedness money that's that's I mean anybody with playfulness I know she doesn't like drama, so level-headedness might work. Playfulness, longevity, sense of adventure, optimi op optimism. I'm going to go with level-headedness. Extreme sports you most want to try. Ooh. Man, Jacob and I be all about the trying the string sports. Let's see here. I think he says he has gone skydiving before. We've done indoor skydiving, at least. He's not into hunting. So, scuba diving or exploring? Hmm. I'm thinking mountain climbing just because we've we've done the rock wall. And I don't think I've ever remember him mentioning anything any interest in scuba diving. Surfing, yeah. Pick a place to live. 
Hmm. Now this is the one I was expecting. Well, she likes... She lives in L.A. She goes to the desert sometimes. That's me right there. Goodness gracious, I would love that. A cave in the mountain? Yes, please. Um... I think she'd pick, like, one of these two. Hey, um, and we're back, and there's a lot of construction going on. You're probably going to hear that on my end. I am sorry. And Jacob changed his coloring on his camera <laughs> when we came back. I changed the white balance. Ugh, I was too red. Now I look like I'm choking. Oh, you look fine. Okay. Thanks. Should I go first or should you go first? Now I'm going to be blue because I'm looking at my iPad. I'll turn the brightness down on my iPad. I don't want it to die anyways. How about you go first? Sweet. Okay. Um. Do I change forms? Oh Do you change forms? As no. In, no? Nope. Okay. Um. Am I a zombie? No. Oh, okay, fine. As much as you like the old zombies, you're not a zombie. That's not what I wanted, but the one I wanted does change forms, so it can't be that one. <laughs> Am I living? Yes. Thought I was going to be a skeleton. Am <laughs> I You can't ask minotaur? multiple questions. You have to take No. A oh, what were you saying? A skeleton isn't living. I'm saying what I thought I was from the start. Oh, okay. What were you saying? But I'm wrong. Anyway, I'm asking, am I a minotaur? I don't know why it would be a minotaur. It just kind of popped out. All right, you go ahead. Okay. Um, can I pass off as human? Yeah, you could. Okay. You definitely could. Am I an elf? <laughs> You're an elf. <laughs> <laughs> wow. Nice. All right. Oh. <laughs> uh... I win this one, well I won the last one. <laughs> You're a pro. Alright, am I... Do I have... Am I like a... Am I beast-like? Yeah. I guess it depends on what you would consider beast. You are animal-like. I'll go with that. Animal-like. I feel like if I was a werewolf, you would just like, yes, and then, but I'm animal-like. I'm clearly not a werewolf. Good, because um, I would have been upset. <laughs> <laughs> that's what I thought you were going to be. That's what I was hoping but I was going to be. Like, <laughs> I was like, oh, okay. Um, let's see. You said I'm animal-like. Am I, am I a swamp monster? No. Well. That would be funny. Mm, no. They don't really, they aren't really considered swamp monsters. Okay, so I guess I'll just go again then. Yep. <laughs> uh, they aren't really swamp monsters. Am I from the ocean? Yeah, I think so. Body of water. Body of water. Am I a... A giant squid is not a mythical creature. Am I a kraken? No. No, that's clearly from the ocean. That was a bad guess. <laughs> am I... Am, can I talk? Yes. Am I a mermaid? Yes. Merman? I'm a merman. Oh, yes. nice. <laughs> Interesting. Why is that? So. I guess I'll have to watch and see all the questions. Yeah. Um, I did spend a lot of time swimming this weekend. <laughs> oh, yeah. We'll sure. talk about that. So, mine... Cool. Uh, my Do quiz... I get a trident? Ooh, I don't know. My quiz also gave percentages of what like the creatures were. So you were eighty three percent mermaid. And then the next closest the next closest was sixty seven percent vampire and sixty seven uh percent Frankenstein's monster. What was my second one? It was a tie between vampire and Frankenstein monster at sixty seven percent. Which these don't like equal up to be a hundred percent, so that makes actually really no sense. But uh, I think it's like you have that much percentage in common with 
that monster. Oh, okay. Well, then you have six. And then you're just the most common with the, uh, the old merman. Okay. So I told you to take, like, a screenshot of the like what the answers, like, the little summary is. So I'll go ahead and read yours. Uh, you are a legendary aquatic creature with the up, upper body of a human and a t the tail of a fish. Fish like you are sometimes associate with um, events such as floods, storms, shipwrecks, and drownings. In folk traditions, or sometimes within the same tradition, you can be benevolent or beneficent, bestowing boons, or fall in love with humans. Which, like, is not as cool as... I, I should have done a different quiz, I guess, because that doesn't, like, What did like, you think say, I was going to do? Hmm? What did you think I was going to get? What did I think you were going to get? Uh, I don't yeah, know, did you I have, really like, have a oh, guess. You're... You said zombie, I think, in a previous conversation. I don't know if it was on air or not. I said zombie for me because oh. I just took a guess of something that didn't transform. Because I was thinking vampire, werewolf, all that stuff, and I was like, okay, well, now i got to try to think of something that doesn't transform. And I just was thinking about zombies from Skittles. So. Uh, yeah, I got you. That's when you brought it up. You got Elf. I'll uh, bring it on screen so we can see. Um, you beautiful, aloof creature. You're one of the most revered and honored creatures in the fantasy world, but you're also very hard to pin down. You're an interesting mix of empathetic politician and pragmatic dreamer. You believe in the power of justice, but you also believe in the power of protecting yourself. You are always willing to lend a hand, but not to the point where it will negatively affect you. Sounds perfect. Sounds just like me. See, that's what I was hoping yours would yeah. do, but I didn't actually reread it. So, like, oh, I just, if I had done a different quiz, I would have been able to, like, it would have Which said. one did you do? It, I did another one, and you were a trickster god. <laughs> huh. But that, that was from cool. the Supernatural TV show. Uh, it says, um, I did mine, which supernatural creature are you? And it's from, uh... And I, I burned you pretty hard, too. I called you a hobbit. <laughs> Why are you so mean? You know what? That's fine, because I burned you pretty hard in yours. Oh, perfect. I kept saying... I, so, I kept like, saying... For. <laughs> I kept saying, where's the video game options? None of these options have video games. <laughs> <laughs> what is the nerd option? nice so, no i even like in the video you'll see i say um i'm like oh no this is where jacob's and my friendship ends because we realize we know nothing about each other <laughs> oh man my first one had like so many in-depth questions about like what your like core motivations were and like what what keeps you awake at night and i was like i don't know <laughs> i have no idea what keeps you awake at night like there were some deep questions Mine didn't have any deep questions. Stuff of was like, what's your favorite color? And I was like, I know that one. That's blue. Yeah. Then I went to BuzzFeed, and it was like, what's your favorite color? Perfect. <laughs> All right. Okay. Um, We'll have links of the ones that we did. Uh, I think that's it for yeah. that. Uh, we have a couple more specials. I think we have two more specials. Yeah. Yeah. What's our next one? Or do you want to talk about it later? Shit up we hmm, should we do that or should we wait until they find out for next week let's make them wait Ooh, <laughs> jacob's evil i think Trick i did put that in the no, i'm just kidding i think there was a question on the quiz <laughs> will jacob make them wait yes <laughs> okay guys well thanks for joining us check out the podcast episode i'll include the link in below and you can check out our whole podcast um the episode it's about our episode uh, supernatural creatures so uh, right on topic That's right so until next time guys see ya see ya and jacob <laughs> you got a mermaid <laughs> oh that's gonna be interesting for you to try to guess that one probably this one i don't know why oh interesting an elf